hi to everybody in this video we are going to talk about the variance of the oilless intercept in previous class we estimated beta zero hat was equal to y bar minus beta one hat x bar if we plug y bar to our beta zero hat equation it will be beta zero is equal to beta zero hat is equal to beta zero plus beta one x bar minus u bar minus beta one hat x bar if we will take this the x outside the bracket it will be beta zero hat is equal to beta zero minus beta zero beta one hat minus beta 1 x bar plus u bar we take this the expected value of the both side equations we will get its expected value of the beta 0 expected value of the beta 0 is equal to beta 0 minus x bar minus expected value of the beta 1 hat minus beta 1 we close in the bracket and plus expected value of the u bar and we know that the u bar expected value of the u bar is the zero expected value beta 0 hat minus beta 0 square is equal to in the bracket we open in the bracket u bar minus in the bracket beta 1 hat minus beta 1 x bar square if you will open it the bracket of the square you will get it the expected value of the u bar square minus 2 u bar multiplied by x bar multiplied by in the bracket beta 1 hat minus beta 1 and plus x bar square in the bracket beta 1 hat minus beta 1 square and we close in the bracket if we will open it the expected value for the each variable inside our bracket will get its expected value of the u bar square minus 2 u bar and expected value of the x bar multiplied by in the bracket beta 1 hat minus beta 1 plus expected value of beta 1 hat minus beta 1 square multiplied by x bar square since we know that the expected value of the u bar is the zero expected value of the u bar square plus uh, the constant number they can go outside it's the expected value x bar square and inside the remain it's the expected value of the beta 1 hat minus beta 1 squared they will give us it's the variance of beta 1 since we calculated in the previous videos of a beta variance of the beta 1 hat we plug to our equations the variance of beta 0 is equal to expected value of the u bar square plus x bar square multiplied by variance of beta 1 not expected value of the u bar also means u bar divided by n square also is equal to 
in the bracket expected value of the u1 divided by n square plus u2 square divided by n square and they can go until the un square divided by n square we close in the bracket if we can simplify our equations this one also is equal to one over n square is the common they can go outside the bracket in out inside the bracket we have this the expected value of the u1 square plus expected value of u2 square and they can go until that's the expected value of the u n square and this one also all of them is that sigma square n times sigma square divided by n square and we will get this the sigma square divided n and we will plug to our equation the variance of beta 1 beta 0 hat is equal to sigma square n plus x bar the variance of beta 1 is it's a sigma square you see summation of the x i minus x bar and you will get this variance of beta 0 is equal to sigma square we can take this outside the bracket we will get 1 over n plus x bar divided by summation of the x i minus x bar square that's our the variance the formula of the variance thanks to